Hello Taurus. My name is Aziza. I'm reading today for the Taurus sign, Love Life, for September 2019. What do you see about Taurus Love Life for September 2019? Taurus for 2019 Love Life. What do you see about the Taurus Love Life for September 2019? Okay. Taurus, it sounds like you are moving forward with love. There is love in the air. There is love, so much love. But you need to isolate something that you are being selfish about. You have selfishness and love. You want everything for yourself. Like, you no, know, I want the, I want it certain way, this way. You need to be strong also. The person that you thought that they are so much connected with you are separated from you. They were spying on you, wanted to see like know what's going on with you, but they are trying to isolate their emotions and feelings at this time from you because it wasn't balanced. It didn't get anywhere of what they want from you. So you feel that you wanted them to be stronger in love, to continue with you, but they are pushing you away, actually. I'm sorry. Wow. Okay, what happened here? What happened that you did not want to be in commitment with this actual person, even if you love them so much? You do. I know. I see that. You love them so much and you just could not really connect there. Okay. Um, the person that has separated from you, they still wish for you. They feel that they want to succeed with you but they are succeeding in becoming stronger at this time and looking into themselves. Even though the other person love you so much, they left you alone, they isolate you, but you want that communications between you and the other person to continue to make it positive. But if you keep focusing on what you want only and focus on what you want, like you know, in, selfishly, the other person is not going to be giving you what you want. So you need to be careful about that too. Okay. Um, because this is, see, you want everything for yourself the way you want to. And this is not helping the other person to continue with you. You see what I mean? Okay. I know you love them and there is love here in the middle between you and the other person. There is an actual genuine love that this person offered you. But with your action here, with your action, with the selfishness here, you know what happened? You push them away and now they are pushing you away. You cannot do that, okay? If you want this actual person, you have to find the balance. The balance is something to do with commitment. Um, but it sounds to be that it's not really something in your agenda. There is, you know what's the problem with the other person? Even you want everything for yourself, the other person is focused so much on the obligations, the obligations which is commitment, the actual settle down relationship. This is how they don't feel really good about you. There is so much negative there. The negative is something to do with you are not into them. They, they see everything in dark or... Uh, or uh, they are not seeing things eye to eye like you. You you mean well, you mean love. You want to continue with this person with love, but you ignored what the actual person want and the actual person looking at you as you are the bad person and you are not a bad person at all. Um, you miss him or her 
very much, dear Taurus. You start to doubt like there is something wrong with you. They, they don't actually want you. Maybe they want someone else. You feel left in the cold. You feel like, you know, just being alone at this time. And actually, it's not true. They want you. They still love you. They they just want you to pay attention to details like, no, why did you do this to me, your partner or uh, the, the person that left you? Why you didn't marry me? Why you didn't be with me? Why you are focused on the on the sexual or intimacy only? You feel like you no know, doubting and doubting, but they doubt themselves too because they think there is something wrong with them. But there is nothing wrong with them. It just it's not your timing to be actually committed. You don't feel it with this person like you know, to be committed to. Even you feel. And this person actually your soulmate. They feel you are their soulmate too. When there is a settle down in this relationship with the person who just left you, you will be with them forever. You want to be with them forever, but you wanted to keep it just an actual love, a happiness, beautiful intimacy. Well, if you want to go to a new person, they will want the same thing. Even if they don't show it to you in the beginning, every person wants to settle down with the one they love. In the past, this person doubted themselves very much, but they are shocked right now that there is nothing wrong with them. They miss you. You miss them. Taurus, you are being careful at this time. Like, no, okay, I will connect. I will try to talk to them. But I'm not committed. It's like you are already ready for it. Um, they're going to keep holding back if you just say, hey, how you doing? Oh, hey, uh, uh, you need uh, something or it's not going to work because they just want a relationship with you. It's very simple. They want a relationship with you. So you want to give them that relationship, they will go along with you with that, whatever. They're just holding on you for commitment and marriage. You will come like you know, to explain yourself and everything, but you will make them mad. Do not explain yourself, please. Take it simple and easy with the other person. I know you are fragile. You are a very loving and wonderful person. Um, you love love. You look for uh, happiness. Um, but the other person is not really understanding this. Uh, they want the best out of this relationship, especially with you, because you are, you mean a lot to them. And they mean a lot to you. I, I, I do understand that and I see it. At the end, you're going to keep waiting and they are going to be letting go. Be careful. You're going to lose. You're going to lose. I, I, I think in, in, a, uh, in my previous August one, I mentioned the same thing exactly here. But it sounds here that you are, if you, if this actual person doesn't respond to you, you will want to move forward to a new love. Let me see when this is a new love coming for the Taurus. Are you going to be still with this actual person that just separated from you? Or you are going to be getting a new love and when this is going to happen? Let me see here. Okay. Taurus. For Taurus. Taurus, will they have a new love or will they go back to... The person that just separated from them or what's going to happen? Taurus. Okay, Taurus. For September 2019, I'm sorry, I have to mention that. Okay. You got your wish. With the person that they stop on you, you feel, you know what the reason they stopped on you. You know they are good people. That's a good person. 
you're going to keep them around still. You're going to continue to talk to them, initiate something, but... I see a trip for you here. You are going somewhere. But you are not going to be really trying to have a new relationship at this time until you come back. Okay. You are free, but still holding on another person with this is the person that just left you. Okay. But you are keeping like you know, this communications once in a while. Yes, I see a good news associated with love. Uh, It's going to happen in the month of September here. You will start a new relationship, but I see you keeping your freedom still. So it's not an actual commitment also. It will be an intimate one, but you still like in, in, in the back of your mind waiting for the other person who just left. You still want them to come around and do an effort with you because this is your favorite. you like them there are messages between you two it could be emails could be phone calls text messages i see you focused a lot like no uh, on uh, internet someone who left you long time ago this is not the person we are talking about in the beginning here somebody left you long time ago it seems to be in a relationship that was for a long time you still prefer that person, number one. It could be a wife. You are divorced. But that's the person that you wish for. To be with you again and come back to you. After that relationship, you decided to be free and you didn't want any relationship because it just it does overwhelm you with commitment. And you prefer to have your free your freedom. You feel lucky that way. It's not wrong. It's not wrong. But, you know, watch for other people's feelings also. You need to explain yourself and uh, be clear to new relationships as that you don't want to take it to the next level. Because people get upset about it and fall in love and they want more and you didn't explain yourself uh, explaining it later it's not going to do you any good so you have to make your intentions really clear from the beginning i know you have a good intention for other people you don't want to hurt anyone you focus on love you want happiness which is good it's nice but don't give them any mixed signals because mixed signals is gonna get really bad at the end for you I know a lot of people, they start a relationship, they don't know like what's coming or what's going to happen. They leave their options open, like no, in a way that, I'm sorry, not option open. Like what I meant exactly that, let me go with the flow. I don't know what's going to happen. That's why I'm not saying anything. At least you say that. Then you can explain yourself later after a few months if it doesn't work. Say no, I'm not willing to commit. Um... You have a lot of disappointment here because sometimes also you say things that hurt another person's feelings because you get the information or, uh, or words out of your mouth without thinking or in a rush that hurt the other person's feeling and you think like, what did I do? What did I say? So they just back off on you and you like, what is it? It just think about you before you speak. When you think of before you speak, Life will get better with the person you are with. So I still see you like you know, having your freedom. I am not getting like you know, a relationship that you are holding on. But in a year from now, it sounds like you are going to be committed to someone. That's going to happen naturally. This is the person that they just recently left you? Hold on. Or 
a new person that you never met before. Is it a new person that you will be committed to? Or someone that left you recently? Actually, if you don't rush for the person who just left you now, they will end up with someone else. You're going to be with someone else also. Okay? I hope this resonates with you. And uh, I'm sorry, it sounded like you are, you lost your chance with this person that loved you so much. Um, maybe that's the way you want it. I shouldn't be sorry. But everything is meant to be. It will happen in time also. Um, thank you, dear Taurus. And this is for uh, your reading for September. Please leave your comments below if you need a private reading please contact me on mysticalaziza.com any emails you need to send send it on aziza at mysticalaziza.com the information you need is below this video thank you love and light